like to make a move Treat me like a queen, now you got me feeling thrown we are in New York for the week, about to head down to the Hamptons. First things first, you have to try the street rice and lamb. We can't wait. Uh, we haven't eaten yet today. Yeah, so that's first thing on the menu. Have you got uh, two lamb over rice? No tomato and no green pepper. You having this? <laughs> I'm a New Yorker now. In New Yorker now? Let me hear your New York accent. Get out of the way. <laughs> I, I'm walking here. I'm walking here. <laughs> say you're safe from many to come, but I never know. And I'm saying all this time, I've just been out here living in the moment. I know you know, keep it way down low, sunrise shadows. Oh my god. It is really good. Right amount of spice. Yeah. Right amount of sauce. Good job to that guy that made it. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm talking all around the clock. I'm talking home, nobody knocks. I'm talking opposite of soft. I'm talking wow, wow, thoughts. You gotta keep up with me. I got some young energy. I got the L O V E. How do you do this to me? Better get on myself. When you get close to me, baby, my tongue goes numb. That's you know that song? Sounds familiar. That's um, it's an Afrobeat song. It's not coming to me right now, but he's playing an Afrobeat song. If you know the song, comment it below. We're about to try this place called No Glue because people are saying that it went viral for the marshmallow and hot chocolate thing going on, this right here. So let's try it out. Oh, they have frozen hot chocolate. What's frozen hot chocolate? Caramel of the marshmallow, half Oreo on top, and half oh, hot Okay, yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Here. What are we thinking about this? So first of all, it was fourteen dollars for this thing. Fourteen dollars. It's very sweet. It's definitely one of those things that you want to share with someone. I don't know if I'll just get this for myself. I never ate the person just... I was talking before. <laughs> Ella is just ad libbing everything. What would you rate it out of ten? I would give the flavor a 6 out of 10 because for me it was just way too much sugar and too chocolatey too thick but for presentation and uniqueness I'll give it a 10 out of 10. Oh okay for me I would give the taste and everything a nice 7 out of 10 and presentation <laughs> I'll give it a 10 out of 10. Um, I want to dance! A bit... <laughs> It is morning time and I want to show you the Hamptons Airbnb. Let's start at the entrance. This is the entrance. It's a little foyer. You go upstairs and you get to the living room which has a ping pong table in it. Uh, it's very spacious and it has a lot of skylight which is really nice. A little dining area over here. Coming into the kitchen. Look at all that skylight. Look at this backyard. So we have a huge deck right here. And then we have this huge pool, more deck space. A little over here is like a beach thing. So that's pretty cool. So here's the rest of the property very quick. There's not much, it's just different rooms, different bathrooms, there's nothing crazy to show. So here's a little fast forward action for you. The place was very cozy, very clean, very nice. And it was in a pretty good area in Southamptons. And that concludes the tour. Myself and Luke are about to go explore because we haven't really had a chance to explore the Hamptons yet. It's his birthday. Let's see what we find in the Hamptons.
It was like Shutter Island. <laughs> <laughs> the tiredness is getting very real so we are heading to starbucks i'm gonna be the navigator the hamptons everything seems very far this starbucks is 10 minutes away and if you've been to america or live in america you know that usually you can find a starbucks five minutes away in any direction this one is 10 minutes away and this is the only one in this vicinity. Luke is training to drive his cyber truck by driving the Raptor. How do you feel so far driving it? This thing is huge. <laughs> this is a, by far the biggest vehicle I've ever driven. Try it. Try the brain freeze. <laughs> mm -mm. Put it on the top of the roof of your mouth. I like Starbucks coffee the best. Like in terms of uh, iced coffee. Because of all the caramel they put in it. Yeah. They make the best sweet drinks. Something, I don't know. On the way to the beach. But it's the thing that I think it's part of the beach party. Copper's Beach. Cooper's Beach. Cooper's Beach. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's supposed to be a, like a DJ set dance party type thing going on. But it got canceled because of the weather. It's very rainy. We got kind of lucky with the weather because, you know, it's the Hamptons, it's August, it's supposed to be sunny. But this whole week, it just has rain. But hopefully it's not, that's not what happens. But it's definitely giving that vibe. Not sure if this camera is showing it good enough, but these waves are crazy. No one is going swimming in this, in this water. Wow. I've never seen waves like that before. Careful. <laughs> We're trying to get a better look at these houses. Very nice houses. But this one looks haunted. You just change the roof and we'll be alright. If you see a ghost girl looking at you, just look away. Look <laughs> away. You trying to make a bench? Yeah. Sirs. You have to make a hole first and then. And then we could have made a bench out of it, but we don't have the tools today. Ah, yeah. number two beach in America. That's crazy. What does the scale comprise of? How do you rank a beach? <laughs> like, if, you can't even swim in it. Is it the quality of the sand? Is it? It's a psychology. If you say number, if you say number one beach in America, no one's gonna believe you. But if you say number two beach in America, that might be like, oh, true. Maybe. No touch it for us. Day three in the Hamptons, or technically day two in the Hamptons. We're about to go out. I'll probably go get some sushi at some point. We're gonna go to my sister's showroom, which is also in town. Luke hasn't seen it yet, so he's gonna get a chance to see it. This is the store. What do you think? Nice. Which store do you like better, this one or the New York one? Um, they're just different, right? Yeah. The New York one is for brides and it's, um, I don't know, it's like bigger, grander and stuff, but mm -hmm. this is really nice for, for what it is. It's really yeah. Like it's, it's a different store for a different purpose. Yeah, different vibe. Yeah. We have an event we're going to on Saturday and I have to pick out a dress to wear. Hopefully I can find something that fits me. So I'm gonna get something from in here to wear because I brought two black dresses that are potential options if I can't find anything at all. But I'd rather find something in here, you know, to represent the brand. I love these shorts. I love when shorts are kind of like skirt, but then also are shorts. <laughs> This could be an option. I like the, it's my style. So maybe this. This could be an option as well. This is the cutest. It has three bowls and a nice neckline. And it gives you like some shape. And it has big arms. I think this would be really flattering on my body type, but will it fit? It's a size one. Ooh. 
Maybe not. If I had to pick, I will probably choose this green. But once again, I don't think this is going to size me. It's tried to try to this one on. It's not even going past my butt. So this is obviously a huge no. Okay, this one is another one. It is very cute, but it's, it's kind of big. I love the color on my skin. However, I wish it had a bit more shape. And I kind of wish the neckline was a V. I'm not really into like high up necklines like this. This is what it looks like. Nice but no shape. But I love the arms. So this is the third one. And it's definitely more fitted, which is nice. What do you think? That dress one. It's the nicest one, yeah. It's the nicest one, right? Yeah. Yeah. That one's really nice. Yeah, yeah her waist is snatched. Mm -hmm. snatched. Yeah, so this is... Probably wow. the win. Yeah. I don't know what I'm gonna do about this though. This is just even. <laughs> it's giving you vacation. Giving vacation for sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, everybody has a timeline. It's summertime. It's summertime. Yeah. yeah. See, Ella looks like a zebra. We are back to bamboo. We came here last year, and they have fantastic sushi. You have? Yeah. I've been here before too. What? I did not see you. I was with you, Ella. No, you wasn't. Yes, I was. No, you wasn't. Yes, I was. Let me look how yeah. we got last time. I'm trying the hot sake. They, they call it rice wine, right? Yeah. So how is it? It's similar to hot sake. It's okay. The process kind of like is similar to rice, uh, sorry, wine, but they make it with rice instead of Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Feels like a stronger version of wine. Oh, really? Yeah. Chicken, pork, or shrimp with it? I'll do shrimp. Mm. First time trying the lemon drop that my sister always gets. Oh, that is good. I can try to get it. Mm. <laughs> can I try a fry? Mmm. Mm. Yes, that's me. Mm, that was good. Wow, it's good. <laughs> what did you get? Well, let's get udon instead. It's like the exact same store that is right mm -hmm. inside the same store. Just finished eating, going for a walk. Oh, really? <laughs> On our walk, we came across this very high end art gallery, and the scariest thing happened to me. I was trying to get a video, a freaking lousy video for Instagram Reels of this painting right here, and I almost knocked over an art piece. My actual life almost flashed before my eyes. It was so scary. What is that? It's a, like a DJI Osmo Pocket 3, so it's like a gimbal. So cool. Yeah. Oh, did you see this? Oh, you yeah. have one. You have one? You have the... Yeah, that oh, that's oh, the... Oh, can I see that one? I've never seen that one before. This is the two, uh, pocket two, right? That is the pocket yeah. two. Yeah. Trust in the hustle and all will be well. And this is like a Louis Vuitton box with butterflies coming out of it. That ball is that's, so cool. This is cool. Statue of Liberty drawn with like many people. That's really cool. Oh, that, that is nice. A Birkin with... Uh, butterflies coming out we are in day four and day three in the Hamptons we're about to go for a walk because yesterday I didn't go for uh, 10,000 steps and we try to do 10,000 steps every single day it's the first day that we've been here that is actually genuinely nice outside it's always been raining so it's actually sunny now yeah look it's nice no rain in sight which is fantastic You gonna skip this rock? Let me see what it looks like. Yeah, That's a nice flat rock. Basically, too. the perfect skipping stone. So okay, let's, let's see it. Ah. Oh, you're feeling it? Yeah. <laughs> okay, now now the pressure is on. I got one too. Okay, let's see this. Oh no. Oh, oh no. That's a hunting boat. Yeah. yeah. They decorate it to look like the environment, and then that little triangle that's cut out there in the boat, they will stand behind there with their gun, mm -hmm. and they'll shoot. 
whatever they're hunting, ducks or pheasants or whatever. Damn! I've never seen that in my life. And it has a tip just like Point Peely. Yeah, these beach houses, I know they're in the millions. Is what I'm wearing to dinner. Well, lunch because it's like three o'clock. Yeah, we gotta go. Hello, come on, we gotta go. And this is the purse I am carrying. White from White. Zara. Ella, say hi, hello. <laughs> Your outfit is so colorful. My daddy said put this in my arm. What is your favorite thing in the Hamptons? My favorite thing was the... My favorite thing... Hmm, what do you guys come in here? Aww! Aww. How cute! We did not tell her to say that. <laughs> This is the same color I'm gonna be wearing to the gala. You'll think I love this color, which is not wrong. <laughs> but damn, I am wearing the hell out of this color on this trip. Apart from this, all I wear is the workout clothes, pretty much. So, fun times. I thought the one with the brick on it. They're so small. Look at these cars. They're so tiny. It's like Aston Martin. And the Ferrari over there. Ferrari over there. Two Ferraris. Another Aston Martin in that corner. Look how small it is compared to a fully grown human being. Look at that. Crazy. Oh yeah, that's a good idea to do that. Yeah. Aesthetic is a 10 out of 10. Aesthetic is a 10 out of 10? Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's self serve. I'm excited for this. Oh, <laughs> okay. Pretzels? Yeah. Daddy, daddy. Yeah. Good. This is a lot. We filled our stuff too high. Yeah, we did. You guys did not skip. Oh well, we're sharing. Wow, well, yeah, we're, we're, we're done. That's, yeah, we're done. We're done. <laughs> Look at that. Hi. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we went all out on this one. Yeah, so there's very 61. Okay, not that bad. 61? Yeah. My son is coming up and watching. Can I have all the work? Mm-mm. Mm. We're gonna have dinner in a few hours. Dessert before dinner. Yeah, backwards. Dessert before dinner. Yeah. Do you have any That's what you need. Best way to eat. Dessert and then dinner. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is better lighting. Show us. Aww. Look at me. Aww, that's so cute. Look at me. Okay. Ah, okay, so go. cute. I think this might be the first windmill I've seen in person. The first what? Windmill I've seen in person. In person? Yeah. You see that guy in the blue shirt over there with the woman with blonde hair? On the other dock. Yeah. Yeah, that's him. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. I guess he does it very well though. Can you send it to me? Yeah. It's like a go-kart, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Uh, it's so small.
You guys are ready too? Bye. Mademoiselle, yes. I hope you're ready. Um, can I please get the steak and fries? The, which one, sorry? The uh, New York Times yeah. steak and fries. You were watching this for social media. You guys all got the same thing. Oh, wow. Super freaks. Oh, it doesn't rain. Those are chicken. Looks like it's gonna one last stop before the end of the night. Oh, the party's over? It's a consignment store, but like a high-end consignment store. So you'll see prices in the thousands, more than likely. And they have these really cool pieces, like one-of-a-kind pieces. Look at this over here. This is like a boxing glove chair. And it's like everlasting boxing, boxing glove. Chair. I think it's a chair. I yeah. think so. It's so cool, right, Ella? Yeah, I'm going to yeah. sit down. And it has like... It's a boxing glove chair, silly uncle. Why are you not letting me sit that's really, yeah, it's a chair. <laughs> this mirror is huge. That is like the biggest mirror I've ever seen. <laughs> it's high. You can't really see how big it is, but it's a big mirror. Just to give you some uh, reference, look at this. Look at me beside it. good like Rob Bobby, nothing is here from last year. Oh, really? Everything's new. Yeah, it's day five in New York, day four in the Hamptons. We are just kind of relaxing before we have the gala. Everyone's getting in the pool except for me because I don't know how to swim. <laughs> in the meantime, we have this going on. Spread your legs wider. A little bit wider. There you go. Now you have more balance. Good job. Benjamin, Ella, Benjamin. That was a record. Ella is surfing. Yay. Bend your knees. Don't forget to bend your knees. Oh, yeah. There you go. Can I jump now? Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> About to get ready for the gala, and this is what I am going to be wearing. It's a dress by SS Anabor from her Ready to Wear collection, my sister. And we're gonna see more dresses like this at the gala because she's having. A fashion show as well at the gala so I'm really excited for that. I have a dilemma. My sister is not going to be here to help me with this dress and usually she's the one that knows how to do it the best especially with the rope like the tie-in girdle thing at the back so we're gonna have to figure out a different way to put it on. Luke you are about to be up to help me with this so we'll see how this goes. You have to zip the bottom first. A few moments later. We have the dress on. I'm going to use Bond number nine, New York City. Madison Square Park actually matches the dress. And we are good. Looking like something out of Bridgerton. And we are going to Vamanos. We are on the way to the gala. Looking spiffy. Thank you. So are you. Thank you. Should I do it? Yeah. What is she doing? Which leg is she using? Her left leg. One leg? <laughs> I can't do it. Like a soap. 
cameras these people had a whole club in their basement this kind of hamptons money is different kind of money they had a whole fully functioning club in their basement fully equipped with a bar strobe lights a dj section lounge chairs everything it was crazy back to the regular programming <laughs> We are officially back home and I'm tired, tired. Ooh. And this, my ribs are about to definitely have, I feel like they're about to be bruised or something. Cause this isn't as tight as hell, but I survived the night. I'm so excited to take this off. You know that feeling when after wearing something that's so comfortable for hours, you finally get to breathe properly. Oh, it's about to be amazing. Day six. About to go to Orient Point. This is what I'm wearing. So we are at Duria's Orient Point, New York, about to get some dinner. We are like half an hour late, but hopefully we will be fine. Hopefully they held our reservation. Hopefully. You weren't here last time, but I was here last time. The food is really good. It's very like Mediterranean and they have a really nice view of the, what's, what's this thing called? A port, I guess, yeah. With all the boats out and it's just a really cool vibe. You feel like you're like in a different country, which is always nice. <laughs> when you are not paying different country money. What do you think about this restaurant so far, like from ambiance and everything? It's got the vibes. It's got the vibes. Yeah, it's nice. We're on the port. There's uh, boats behind us. Like, Isn't this thing like really cool? Yeah. It adds like a certain vibe. Fishnet. Fishnets. <laughs> Who would have thought that fishnets would do it? Yeah, it's like very unique umbrellas and, uh, I don't know, shade here. It's yeah. Cool. Oh, this one's 300 too. It comes with lobster. Look at these prices. Freaking cob salad, $97. They said, bring your funds, bring all your coins. Oh, yeah. I'm having a little bit tipsy. <laughs> yeah, it's tipsy. Oh. Mediterranean spread. Oh yeah, yeah. I remember the hummus here. Yeah. Really good. The hummus here is so good. If, or yes. you have, oh really? When we did the photo shoot, was that last year? Oh yeah, oh, it's so good. Like, oh. Most of the things say it serves two to three people. Watch oh, my story. Look at you. Uh, Andrew? Oh, you guys did the red carpet? Mm -hmm. I, I mean, I didn't do that. When you make a really good story, and you just watch it all day. And you just keep checking the numbers to see who has seen your masterpiece, you know? That was so good. This tastes amazing. It's like the best hummus I've ever had in my life. Bread. Which one? Like, it's like pizza bread. You know how to make hummus? I want a wood for. I tried one time and yeah, it was so close. bad. Yeah, I need to learn so that you can make a hummus. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. We all got the same thing. <laughs> Potato chips. How was it? Good? Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. Lamb chop. 
And I have one who called one hot lobster roll. She's driving with this one. Yeah. This boat is called Flow of Funds. Talk about putting it into the universe. Cinderella. This one's Pronto. That was a cool boat. It reminds me of like those Italian style yeah, like boats. Oh. Going to the beach. This place is so nice. It feels like you're in a different country, eh? Yeah, I could sit here nice. all day. Yeah. It's so relaxing. I found a nice little escape. Nice little rock. escape. I know Michelle. it's so nice. Hi, nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. It's such a pretty space. Do you see the building over there? The St. Patrick's building? It's like a famous building. To rent this place for your wedding is like You're not gonna be here for the fashion show. So what do you think about the location? It's beautiful. That building is crazy. Like the fact that it's overlooking this building. It's so pretty. That way. So they're lined up on this side of the and then they and whatever cue of the music, like, you know, there's things. So this is how the models are going to do their walkthrough during the fashion show. They're going to go from the sides, come around, the corner like that. I think she's going to probably pose at the tip of the pool. Yep, and then come. About to get some lamb over rice for the last time before we head back. That's the money shot. Bye! bye. <laughs> Ella, say bye! Say bye bye! Ah. Miss you, miss you! <laughs>